Right. That's great. Yeah. Uh -huh. and, and we'll have different ways of thinking. And yeah. you can learn something from you, and Mike can learn something from you. <laughs> Good. And uh, well, I can learn something from you. Hopefully. So, so this is where your scenario really starts. Okay. And we're so going you guys from Reading to Arcadia. Yeah, but we're not leaving our ready. We're going to stick it in space. Yeah, we kind of start oh, on the okay. airway or something. So it's kind of like, it's a scenario, it's oh, okay. kind of mindset, but really, we're going to be a really close to Arcadia. And we're going to get a, we're going to pick an approach, how to get in there, and we're going to check the weather. Mm -hmm. One five zero at six. Okay. So, so pretty calm, not things. too bad. Um, One five zero at six. One five zero at six. Okay. So, we're looking so at three two comes over the mountains, kind of off of the coast. One four comes off. One four is a little bit better aligned with the winds. Yeah, but it doesn't go as low. Uh, you got a tailwind. Yeah, yeah. you got what a tailwind, which yeah. is gonna which is gonna push us faster, so faster across the ground. It's only what was it five knot tailwind, so it's not a huge maybe six knots. Are we flying? Should I? Are you ready? Go ahead. Yep. And do we need to brief the mist? We should brief the whole plate. So I did go ahead and kind of cheat and started with the notes section. I didn't see anything for us there. Uh, we are with the Seattle Center. I got got it. I got the weather plugged in there. So if we need to listen to that again. And I got the CTAF on my standby. Looks like we're pretty good uh, downwind there for final on those vectors. Heading inbound will be a 136. 030 to send maintain 3000. Right turn 130 to send maintain 3000. That's a uh, two right zero, zero, three, zero. Zero, three, zero for one. For Change approved. Seven Romeo Bravo. Keep coming down. Come on, baby, break out here. Right, I'd be getting nervous now. I'd be. Oh, I would be. Yeah. I'd be. I'm beyond nervous at this point in real life. <laughs> oh, ground contact. Hey! Okay, there's a runway. Yeah, airport side. Let's let's rewind and kind of play it back, uh -huh. you know, and talk through it a little bit. Um, so interesting points here. So um, ATC is always going to give you vectors, right? That's okay. the first pick because it's a quicker yeah. turn. Yeah. When you do doing the RNAV approaches and stuff like that, they'll they'll all a high percentage of time they'll also give you to maybe an IF. It's part of that turn back and back. This this distance, so it's a ground-based unit that's able to do that. And is that like that loss? Okay, so you're gonna just one second. So, so just so you, everybody's clear on the process. The airspeed, the actual ground speed varies quite a bit. So just be aware of that too. But we're always gonna fly the indicated airspeed. That guy. Yeah, that oh, guy. that guy. We'll keep him Traffic. in sight. Try our turn. Traffic. Uh, I was very impressed. I, I would highly recommend this for any instrument pilot, pilot who wants to just review a lot about instrument flying and do it in a fun kind of setting with a lot of other guys who are doing the same thing.